This is the Lockpicking Lawyer, and today I'm following up on video number 635, in which I showed you how to quickly decode and open this Fortress Model 1850D padlock. And I do mean quickly. You can decode these almost as fast as you can open them if you already know the combination. In that video, I also mentioned that the technique works on several brands of padlocks, which are usually identifiable by a white circle in the center of the dial and a keystone shape stamped in the metal at the 12 o'clock position. Well, a few days after I posted that video, I saw one of these locks in the supermarket while doing some food shopping. And for the $2.99 it cost, I figured I'd pick it up and show you that it does indeed work on other brands of locks. This is that lock, it's the Guard Security Model 1500. And you can see that it has both that white circle on the center of the dial and the keystone shape stamped in the metal at the 12 o'clock position. So we're gonna see if we can decode this, but I'm not gonna to go too much into the details on the decoding procedure. If you do wanna see that, I'll leave a link to video number 635 in the description below. All that said, let's see if we can decode this lock. Now the first thing we do is rotate the dial several times to the right. And after we've gone two or three times around, I'm going to lift up and apply moderate tension to the shackle and keep turning until I hear a click. Okay, you could pretty easily hear that. Now that is not the first digit of the combination. It is two to the right of the first digit. So I'm gonna move it over two positions. We can see the first digit is probably 17. Now I'm going to turn this dial to the left a full 360 degrees. So I ensure that I pass the second digit once. Then I'm going to lift up on the shackle again and keep turning until I feel a stoppage. Okay, I felt it stop. That may or may not be the second digit. If I turn it back the opposite direction and there's any looseness, then it is not the second digit. If however it rubs and is hard to turn, it is the second digit. And there I can feel it's very hard to turn. So the second digit, I think that was somewhere 32, 33, something like that. As for the third digit, I'm just gonna keep rotating this to the right while pulling up on the shackle and the lock should pop open. There we go. So the third digit was eight or nine. So as you can see, very, very easy locks to decode. If you see this white circle on the dial and that keystone shape at the 12 o'clock position, do not rely on this lock to secure your valuables. That's all I have for you today. If you do have any questions or comments about this, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe. And as always, have a nice day. Thank you.